Okay, we're going to talk about how we complete the assessment. You'll notice up here on the progress bar on the left, we're at 91% complete. That's because all of these sections we have checked off as we've gone through them, except for the last section. Sometimes I get questions about why uh, something doesn't show to be complete in the system, why they haven't gotten credit for it yet, and what they're looking at is the asset. Let's go over here and take a look at the asset page. You can see the asset for ethyl methyl death is 100% complete, but the assessment of the asset is only 91% complete. For it to actually be completed, we've got to get to 100% complete, then we have to submit it, then the battalion chief has to approve it. So what we have to do, let's uh, go ahead and mark this section complete. That's the first step. The second thing, it's really important not to hit the next section button like we've been doing up until this point. As we were navigating through each of these sections, we would mark it complete, hit next section. But you'll notice now, up here where the next section button was, it says view asset details. That's because there's not a next section. So if you just reflexively press up here in this corner, then it's going to throw you back into the asset, closing this form. You'll think you're done, but you're actually not. What instead should happen is, after marking the section complete, you press the Save button up here. Once you do that, notice that now we have a Submit button. When you press the Submit button, it's going to give you a chance to back out. It says, okay, once you submit this, you can no longer make changes. Are you ready to submit it? If you're sure you are ready to submit, you hit OK, and then your part's done. At this point, now it's up to the battalion chief to approve of it or to send it back to you for further changes. But that's how you actually close out the assessment. The important thing being don't just reflexively hit up there where you were previously hitting the next section button, but instead press the Save button when you're completing the last section of your assessment.